guys welcome back again if you're coming across this channel for the first time I am Katia Valino I am a lifestyle and beauty blogger please remember to subscribe before we dive into the video so today I want to address this issue of Ned Woko Ned Woko's son and Regina Daniels so we're talking about Regina Daniels step stepson so there's been a lot of controversy and some fluid going on on the internet on the social media about this guy called MZ uh, Ned Woko Jr. So you can tell look at his picture. He looks like his father. So last last month uh, this This transpired between him and Regina Daniel where this is what Regina Daniels has to say on her Instagram and this is the response so he goes hey MZ or whatever you call your ugly self I beg or okay, nobody is misleading and using your dad like you said everything he's doing for me and my family uh, everything he's doing for me and my family he, he's doing it out of love before he came in limelight I was living fine okay so please mind what you say to the public okay so now, MZ said, Wow, Madam Gina, ask yourself this question. Without my dad, will you ever in your entire life own a brabus? Just enjoy it while it lasts. But last, last, I own them all. I didn't mention your name on my post, though. Maybe it's your con conscience by greet dad and everybody now let me show you the post that really triggered this whole uh back and forth so stay here let's look so for the post i went to his facebook page and this is what i saw on the facebook page so he goes so you can address me as mz not as bilonia son my father's wealth is not my wealth my mom has always brought me up to be an independent gentleman. I hustle for my own money since he abandoned us right from when I was a kid. And only God has been my helper. I have never experienced fatherly love since I was a child. Oh my God. So at this time, you can see that this guy, this uh, MZ, his father, Ned Moko, was never in his life growing up. And uh, it says that Regina Daniel is the fifth or the sixth wife. What happens to wife number one, number two, number three, number four, number five? We only saw a little picture, a little information about the Moroccan wife, which you can see. Check it over here. You can tell that the Moroccan wife and MZ get along. Watch out here what happened here. Girls them a come, them a want, them a take up. Bad man, me a come in, me a wanna take up. Girls them a come, them a want in on the take Guy. So the feud continues and on with Regina. They go back and forth. They they interchange insults and words and and a whole lot of stuff that is going on. So my question here is Ned Woko, even before before he got married to Regina Daniel, I don't know anything about Ned Woko. I don't know anything. I don't know anything about Ned Woko. So apparently it's the fame of Regina Daniels that really brought him to the limelight for a lot of people to even know that there is a senator called Ned Woko. So this guy apparently disappeared from the eyes of his children. He was not there when this kid was growing up. And the kid also, this MZ, also he kept telling his mom, saying that the, mo that the mom is the backbone and that uh, you can see he just had a graduation he graduated from university of portacourt so on and on and on in one of the videos where i watched on youtube he said i didn't see that i checked everywhere on the internet i couldn't find that but this guy also said that his mother is a pepper seller hello the mother of Nate Woko's son is a, a pepper seller so 
does it mean that Nedumoko is a scumbag? You had children and you could not take care of these children. Regardless of whatever is the issue, why you are not still with the mom, it's your responsibility to take care of your father. It's your responsibility to take care of your children. I see you as a failed dad. Not every man that has child is capable of being a father. You're not a father figure. You were in there when, when this boy was growing up. And when you look at two of them together, you can see that he is the carbon copy of Nedumoko. So you never played any father role. I could care less what this boy did to you, but for you to abandon your children, instead of, of spending that money on your kids, you were out there throwing up and showing off some stupid effigy just showing off with young girl uh, regina daniel we still don't know what happened to the other wives i was also reading somewhere on the internet where it says that one of the wives is late that uh, she passed some time in london i'm not sure how true that is i didn't see any detailed information where are the other wives so now you are carrying the young girl regina daniel up and down private jet rolex watch all kinds of cars what do you think is going to happen to your own kids let me tell you guys that are watching this video just in case you don't know Nate Nate Moko, Moko is i don't man. care That's who you are or what position if you anything hold happens to him tomorrow i see I'm not saying that he's combat. gonna pass tomorrow but if anything happens to him tomorrow let me tell you guys something I know exactly how things work in the part of Ebola land. You see the Regina Daniel, they will throw you out of the door. I don't care how you think, how you love, how strong that you think that Nedumoko loves you. If anything happens, the Omona, the people over there will just throw you out of the door and everything will belong to the children, especially the male children. Unfortunately, that's how it works in Igbo land. So I know that your mother is wise and smart. So if Rita Daniel, if you're really smart and wise, like you've proven to the public that you are smart, you're wise, you're knowledgeable, you're educated, you're retired, whatever, whatever you call yourself, I think it's your responsibility to try to be, now that Ned is madly in love with your daughter, according to quote unquote, quote that that Ned Moko is madly in love with your daughter. If you're a good mother to your daughter, Regina, why don't you try to call this uh, social media hoopla that is going on to other? Advise Regina to make up with her stepson. Try to step in. Do something recommendable. This boy is going all over the place, uh, throwing shades at Regina, and Regina is also throwing shades back. Nate Walker, you are a failure. Even if you cannot control your son because you were not in his life, at least control your new wife, your young wife. You can tell him that it's okay. Don't go over there to, uh, to pass on comments back and forth with your own child because it's not proper i think that Ned Woko is also enjoying the fame and the publicity that is getting online because like i told you i was not aware of Ned Woko till just very uh, very recently so you are a scumbag whether you like it or not i could care less how many private jets you have but for you to abandon your children doing all these stupid things on the air flaunting money flaunting wealth it doesn't make sense and a lot of people in Nigeria or or in Africa they get away with all this stupidity that they do they have children they cannot pay they don't pay child support they don't they don't take care of these children look at Davido for example Davido come from a very wealthy family and he's a singer and his parents they were there they they they, they supported him throughout his music career and look at your son I watch some of his music on uh, on YouTube. He's upcoming musician. He can do very well. He needs your support, your financial support, and who you know to push this man, this young coming, this upcoming young musician. What do you do with your money? That you have how many acres of land in your town, uh, doing this and doing that, and you are not able to take care of your own blood. You are a failed father. You are woefully. You failed woefully. I don't care if your son can come out there and say that his mother is a pepe seller. 
apparently you were married one time to this woman we don't care I, i'm not here to to find out what transpired between you and your ex-wife but my key thing here is for you to go and take care of your child it's a shame shame on you Ned Moko. it's a very big shame so money miss road i could care less how many master's degree phd whatever you are but if you're out there look at donald trump even if the world doesn't like him he invested in his children and made sure that they are the best of who they are i look at you you carry young girls private jet do this do that you go to functions you spread money on the musicians it's not life it's very very irresponsible of need you need to grow you might be 60 years or 70 years old but as long as you are not there for your children you are not grown you are just a scumbag that's all i can call you scumbag only if tomorrow they turn around and they say that that mz is not your son then i have to take these words back but at this time i don't see you deemed to be a nice nice father you might be the best husband that you want to be that's entirely up to you but going back on the video for the moroccan woman when you look at the picture you can tell that the moroccan woman is also unkept do you just marry these people and just abandon them and keep looking for younger ones and regina if you think that you're 18 or 17 or 21 i don't think that negmoko has stopped you don't wish to be in the same shoe as the ex-wives but you know what i'm not praying bad for you but what goes around comes around also nigerians have some skoi skoi on their head something is going on with a whole lot of nigerians because they think it's money 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 i was also reading some comments where some people are bashing this young man and telling him oh you have to go and get your own share now your father is so rich and you are here fighting with regina nigerians have some mental issues mental problems so because his father has money now he has to go and beg his father and say father can you forgive me this is one of the comments some of the comments that i was reading on social media what happened to your father duty what happened to your father duty let me tell you something Ned Moko. so i am just i just feel so sorry for you if you think that all that glitters is gold your turn will come if you really abandon that young boy i don't know him some people will come here to trash me did anybody pay you to come here and trash Ned Moko? truth is bitter bad truth must be told so i'm gonna leave you guys here subscribe and share this video i will see you guys in my next video bye